What is up, guys? Pal back here once more, and it is Easter. Close enough, kind of. I don't know. There's bunnies. I don't know. And we're gonna play this game, One Night Stand, where we had a stand and it's one night. Ugh. My head. My stomach. I. I feel. I'm pretty. Crap. Oh, that's that's good. That's descriptive. Last night, what happened? I, I don't know. We gotta figure it out, man. Drink. Lots of drink happened. Not drinking, just drink. It's a verb now. Boy, well, see, that's a cell phone, bud. We're a cyclops, apparently. We only have one eye. My phone! Where is my phone? She ate it. Okay. Oh, okay. We gotta we gotta click around. I, I guess we wear glasses or something. I don't know. Go, oh, got it. Okay, we were right. Shh. I I okay. Mate, well, what the hell happened to you last night? I don't, I don't know what kind of accent I was just trying to do. I have no idea, but uh, thanks a lot for waking me up. Oh, jeez. Okay, man. There's gotta be a charger around there somewhere. Better plug it in. Nope, can't plug my phone into that. What are you trying to plug it into, man? I mean, you've been plugging something in last night already, so... Or that. Um, I, I don't think you're home, man. Wait. I don't recognize this bedside table. That is your one-night stand, man. Your nightstand. There's only one, and you can't even recognize... Okay, I'm done. This isn't my room. My clothes, they're, they're all over the floor. Am I dead? I'm completely naked. Hmm. Well, there you go, man. You, uh, oh, I guess I got lucky last night. I guess you did. This must be her room. Well, I hope so. I hope you didn't just find some random dude's home and just like, you know what? Now we're sleeping here. See, there you go. But who is she? Mm -hmm. Oh. All the girls were so pissed off, I can't believe I ditched my date so you could just bail on us all. Shit, sounds like my drunk me was up to no good last night. Ah, typical drunk me. Hate to let my mates down, but I guess my mind just had been elsewhere. Oh, I think something else was elsewhere. Sorry, I honestly don't know what happened to me last night, but guess what? I pulled. Yeah, that should shut him up. Could she be one of the girls from last night that Gary was talking about? Even if she was, I don't know anything about her. I can't even remember her name. That's a good start. Shit, I really can't remember anything that happened last night. I don't even know where the hell I am right now. Oh, this hangover isn't helping. Mm -hmm. Oh, bullshit. One drink and you're off betting women. You're gonna need a better excuse for ditching all your mates than that. Well, dude, I mean, I don't know. I, apparently, I'm too eager and I need to... Stick things in a beaver. I don't. I don't know. Gary doesn't believe me. He sounds pretty pissed off. I'll take a pick, man. You know. You, you know. You're gonna do it. You're gonna do it. If Gary's not gonna take my word for it, I could take a sneaky picture that would jot. See, I. I knew it. I knew. Um. Ah, yeah, screw it. Just do it. Now show him. There you go. One drink. Looks like I didn't need much. Ah, uh, Dutch courage. And phone's dead. Um, well, getting out would probably end it a little bit too. Uh, let's just let's just wake her up. See what happens. Leave me now. Oh, what the? Are we are we getting killed? Did she just throw the the? Uh, I, I we're getting killed. She's gone. Maybe she's a little freaked out about all this. I know I am. Still, I didn't really get a good look at her. Maybe she wants me to leave. Hmm. Well, there's a uh, guitar over there. A uh, book, okay. It's a romance novel, Eyes of Embrace. It sounds... Intriguing. Maybe I should give this a read. Alright, this... Uh, this must be your wallet. Well, I, I don't I don't think you should be looking through it. I, I, I don't I don't know. Um, no, no, we're gonna, we're gonna leave that alone. That's, yeah, that's, that's best. 
Okay. Ah, that probably is the cause of the hangover. Funny, I don't normally drink wine, especially red. I guess drunk me doesn't care what he's pouring in the tank. Riol Risava. Sounds fancy. It's half empty. Uh, half empty, half full, whatever. Oh, hi. Oh, hey. Um, I, uh, yeah, might as well ask if uh, she's okay. Yeah, I'm sorry for uh, dashing out of the room like that. I hope I didn't freak out or anything. I like the animation style. I, I, I really do like it. It's all right. Uh, I was just a little shocked when, you know, I suddenly smothered by a it A duvet. A duvet. I, have, I honestly have never seen that word before. Probably an idiot, but that's okay. Probably another word for blanket, I'm going to assume. Sorry, as soon as I woke up, I just really needed a dash to the bathroom. Well, I mean, that happens. I mean, that's how the human body works. I'd rather not go into this if it's okay with you. Yeah, of course. So, have you been awake long? Not really. My phone woke me up. Ah, I wondered what that noise was. It woke me up, too. Ah, oh, sorry. Oh, don't worry about it. You know you shouldn't have spoiled me with that fancy bottle of wine. Fancy bottle of wine? Well, yeah, you know, the one that's, like, right over there. I mean, I don't know. Well, it's not a fancy bottle. What, what is it? Sorry to disappoint you. I saved the fancy stuff for special occasions. Oh, well, we just got hammered! Well, actually, we did get hammered, but not by the fancy wine, apparently. I'll try not to take that as an insult. I don't normally drink wine. But when I do, I apparently get stuck with uh, with interesting things like this. I don't know. Oh, we didn't drink that, that last night. That's just a bottle I keep by my bedside. Oh. Huh? I like to pour myself a glass when I read. Looks like I can't blame this hangover on the wine, then. This is a little awkward. Um... Right, so that's about the hangover. You have a hangover? Yeah, just a little one. I mostly just feel nauseous after a night out like that. What about you? You don't look too great. Oh, thank you. I mean, I try my best. I'm alright. Um, I, um... Ah, coffee's fine. I, I, coffee's okay. Gotta get that. Gotta get a little French vanilla, some, uh, some, some sugar, some cream. Yeah, that's, we're good. Our grand French vanilla's already in the cream. Uh, don't worry about it. Nice, I'll go put the kettle on and see if we have some instant coffee. All right, that went, uh, well, I think. She seems, uh, I'm, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say cool. Still, I don't even know her name. That is, that is quite the predicament. Let's look up at the ceiling. Oh, no, we can't. All right, what, what's a mirror? It's a mirror! How do I look? Well, I may feel like crap, but I've certainly seen worse. This is a photo. It looks pretty old. That girl's with some guy. Maybe he's a friend or a relative of hers. Or maybe her boyfriend and wears some deep shit. It's a laptop here. Maybe I could use it to find out more about who she is. No, that's not good. Probably. Hey, you, uh, you holding up? How am I holding up? I have no idea. Hmm. Yeah. Fine. Well, I hope this helps. Thanks, it, uh, smells good. You know, I can't smell it, but I'm sure it smells great. Well, it's not Starbucks, but hopefully it'll help, uh, shift that hangover. I really don't like Starbucks anyway, so that's okay. It's delicious. I'm more of a Dunkin' kind of person, so, you know. Feels awkward again. I should really ask her about last night. She must know something. Or not. I, I don't know. I'm not a psychic. That was quite a night, right? Huh? Yeah, it was alright. Oh, wow. Well, self-esteem down! By the way, thanks. Huh? Last night, I was feeling pretty down. I'd always brushed off the idea of meeting up with a stranger through a dating app. Oh, that that's how it was. Well, Tinder strikes again! Why do we always end up in these type of games? Ha, ah, that must be uh, how we met. And uh, then having the guy bail on me in the middle of the date. Okay, well, okay. What an asshole! Indeed. Okay, I think we can assume that uh, the guy wasn't me. I was about ready to jump into a taxi, go home and shut myself in for days. I'm really glad you showed up. I mean, apparently, I, I saw we. You bought me a drink, you listened to me, and it cheered me up. Well, that, that's good. I guess the night turned out around, thanks to you. So she got stood up last night, and I stepped in. Maybe this explains why I accidentally abandoned Gary and my friends last night. Probably. Even if I can't remember anything we talked about. Don't worry about it. Although I think I ended up abandoning my friends by accident. Oh, I'm sorry. 
That's okay. It's there. It's worth it. They're just a little pissed with me this morning. I didn't even realize you were with friends. Yeah, I, I'm surprised I have friends. You didn't mention anything about them at all. Really, I was in a bar with Gary and a couple others uh, people, I think. Huh. You you think? Oh, hang, hang on. Do, do you even remember my name? Ah, shit. Oh, my God. This is humiliating. So you don't remember anything? Oh, God, it gets quiet and all. Oh, this is awkward as fuck. Oh, God. Uh, I'm going to be honest. Not really, no. Well, what, really? You must be pretty confused, then. I'll fill you in on what I know. Okay, that's good. At least she's understanding to some degree. We met at around 11 p.m. by the bar at the Paradox. You'd had a few drinks, but you didn't seem too drunk. He bought me a drink, and we found a secluded spot to chat. We chatted for ages without being interrupted, even in a bar as loud as a paradox. At the end of the night, we both had quite a few drinks. Neither of us were in a state to make good decisions. When the taxi arrived, we both jumped in. And I guess we ended up here. Okay. That's everything I can recall. I don't know anything that happened leading up to this. Sorry, I, it's, I mean, I guess it's fine. Yeah, thanks for filling us in. Would she smile? Oh, no, 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 she's not. Listen, about last night. Yep. Going out, meeting a total stranger, and bringing them here, home. This isn't something I normally do. In fact, I've never done this before. I mean, I assume so. I mean, you don't seem like the type that would. Have you ever done anything like this before? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with no. That's reassuring. It makes me feel a bit less uncomfortable about the whole thing. Silence. It's quite deadly. I guess what I'm trying to say is, I don't want this to be typical. I mean, you're still here. You didn't sneak out before I woke up or while I was out of the room. I don't know. Come on, go for it. Go for it. Clearly you were nice to me last night. Yeah, come on. We're getting it. But part of me thought you'd want to leave as soon as you woke up. But you're still here. Oh, it's a good thing we stayed. I mean that in a good way, of course. She's happy that I'm still here. Yeah. I guess I've managed to make a good impression, all things considered. Oh, this is going well. Listen, we didn't really get to know each other that well last night. We do it now. I ranted about my date and life troubles. I've talked enough about me. Tell me about you. Huh? Uh, tell me something about you. Uh, we'll probably be boring as fuck, aren't we? I know this might sound strange, but if we get to know each other a little better, then maybe this could be different. Different? Dude, she wants to go out with you, clearly. Like, God. Like, maybe this doesn't have to be as weird as just two strangers hooking up. I don't know. Sure, I guess. Uh, what should I tell about myself? Um, let's talk about hobbies. Oh, she's gonna be right back. Okay, well, she's gone. I don't know. That was strange. She turned pale as soon as I opened my mouth. I wonder if I can find out anything more about her. Oh, the music kicks in again. That's cool. Hmm. It's a pile of magazines. There's some music and gaming magazines in here. Oh, that's good. Some of the articles sound pretty interesting. Shame I don't have time to read them now. Ah, here are my jeans. There's a few odd stains on here. I reckon they're good for another day or two. Good man. I really need to find my boxes before I put them on, though. These are all her clothes. Even if I wanted to wear them, I doubt they'd fit. Oh, you can be stylish, man. Hey, you, uh, you okay? Not really. Sorry, I just felt really sick all of a sudden. Maybe it was something I ate last night or t too, uh, too much drink. Mm -hmm. Too much drink. Is, my, is that my phone? Wait, my phone is still dead. What, what, what the hell? Huh? My friend just sent me a naked photo of me. Did, did you take a picture of me while I was sleeping? Aw, oh, shit. Gary, I swear to God. You did something like that? Oh, come on, Gary. What the fuck? This is all over my Facebook. Oh, come on. People send me all sorts of weird messages. 
Oh god, what am I supposed to say to my friends? Oh god, come on! My family, my brother! Well, your brother is family, so... What's wrong with you? Why, why did you do this? Got nothing to say? I really don't. Please just get out. Oh shit. Grab your things and just, just get out of here. Oh shit, what the fuck? What's going so well? You quickly gather your belongings and leave. She doesn't say anything else. She stays in her room while you fumble with the front door lock and exit. You walk hesitantly down the street, wondering how you're going to get home. Well, now I'm depressed. That was awkward. I wonder if things could have been different. They probably could have. Well, uh, now that I'm depressed for the, uh, the night, have a great Easter, guys. Until next time, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go, uh, I don't know. Watch a, watch a sad movie. Until then, guys, like, subscribe, comment. I'll see you next time, guys. See you then.